Hi, it's Tim from Oracle Base. Pum -tum -cum. This video is about collation. This functionality was introduced in Oracle 12.2 and determines how strings are compared, so it affects things like equality tests and sort operations. In order for this to work, we have to have extended data types enabled. Collation supported at multiple levels, but in these examples, we'll just look at column and statement level collation. We set the NLS lang environment variable to make sure our client displays all the characters properly. To see the default behavior, let's create a table with two string columns. We populate it with four rows containing similar data, only differing by case and accents. Notice the differences in the second character of the company column and the third character of the location column. If we do an equality test, we'll only get the rows with the exact match on both case and accent. In a group by operation, each row will be seen as unique. So we have four groups with one row in each group. Let's recreate the table this time with just the company column. Notice we're using collate binary CI, or case insensitive. We populate the data using the same column values we did before. We can see the group by operation is now case insensitive. It still cares about the accents though. So we see two groups of two rows. Let's add the location column and this time use collate binary AI or accent insensitive. We populate the data using the same column values we did before. The group by operation is now case and accent insensitive for this column. All four rows are seen as matching, so we have a single group of four. All the examples so far have used column level collation. Let's try an example of statement level collation. We create and populate the table again, but with no collation defined at the column level. Instead, we define the collation in the select list and the group by. This gives us a single group of four rows because the group is being treated as case and accent insensitive. Thanks for watching. As always, there are links in the description that give you more information about this functionality.